Ahoy there, sailors. Well, I'm back in uh, Annapolis. I have a couple of surveys and sea trials to take care of. So we've left uh, SVC Sprite in Wrightsville Beach, and we'll be heading back down there in a couple of days, get back aboard and get back underway sailing south. In this next video, we continue our adventure heading south, leaving Portsmouth, Virginia, and eventually arriving in Beaufort, North Carolina. Now, sailing a small sailboat in the ocean around Hatteras can be a very daunting undertaking and fraught with risk. Many sailors choose to motor many hundreds of miles down the ICW from Portsmouth to Beaufort to avoid the graveyard of the Atlantic. And few of them are aware that there's an alternative route available that will allow you to sail most of the way. In this upcoming video, we take that route so come aboard with SVC Sprite as we sail down the Albemarle, Roanoke, and Pamlico Sounds and motor a very minimal number of hours to arrive at Beaufort, North Carolina. Yep, uh, it's about 8.30 in the morning. Still pretty calm. Here in our anchorage on the North River. But we're gonna hoist up that anchor and start heading towards Manio, and there is a slight breeze supposed to pick up. Maybe we'll get to sail today. That would be awesome. Hey everybody, we made it to Manio. Got a spot on the free dock, which is always good. And tonight there's a free bluegrass concert right here in town. So we're gonna check it out. I know you be through. Well, there ain't nothing like being the blues. There ain't nothing like being the blues. Ain't nothing like taking what's bothering you. Brother, just cutting it through. We're sailing down the Pamlico Sound on a very, very broad reach on a breezy day. That's free, <coughs> free fuel though. Wind is good stuff. And we get a few swells there, like that one. Uh, but all in all, it's good. So what do you think? It's like, don't bother me, I'm concentrating. I'm concentrating. There's a catamaran over there. We're beating them for a while, anyway. I mean, it's very broad reach. Running downwind, just about. Oh, so down below it's pretty comfortable. 
There are a couple of vessels in distress, as there seems to be every day this time of year, and the Coast Guard's busy on the radio. Um, but all in all, we're, we're doing well. I did want to talk to you about this route we're taking. You know, we, we bought our sailboat because we wanted to sail. And uh, you don't necessarily have to go outside around Hatteras to sail most of the way down to Beaufort, uh, North Carolina, where you can start popping out and doing, you know, shorter offshore legs where you can again sail and, you know, enjoy that free fuel that God gives us as opposed to killing dinosaurs. And so that's what we're doing. All right, so despite making awesome time down the Pamlico Sound today, it seems there's no way we can make Ocracoke before dark, or we'd be pushing our luck. We'd get in there right as it was getting dark. So we're bailing out. We're gonna head into Hatteras Village. There's a marina there. We can take a slip. Nowhere to anchor, but we'll take a slip for tonight. Better safe than sorry. Good morning, sailors. Coming to you from Hatteras Village Marina, Cape Hatteras, North Carolina. It's about 6.30 in the morning. As soon as the sun comes up, we'll cast off the lines aboard SVC Sprite and hopefully make our way to Oriental, another 55 nautical mile day. And uh, the winds are looking favorable for that endeavor. Um, so another day of sailing, sailing along the inner banks of North Carolina, making our way to Beaufort, where, we're, where we will start our offshore legs. Even Cape Hatteras. It's a much, uh, let's say, nicer day today. The winds are lighter. Yeah, we're going a little bit slower, but it's easy sailing and uh, it's very enjoyable right now. Sort of on a broad reach, heading towards Oriental. Okay, so how was sailing yesterday? How would you describe uh, the passage from Manio to Hatteras? Sporty and challenging. Sporty and challenging. I learned a lot. Huh? I learned a lot. You learned a lot. I learned a lot. You helmed very well yesterday in some yeah. challenging conditions. Yeah. Not easy sailing on a very, 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 very yeah. broad reach. It's not my favorite. And following seas that are kind of lumpy. Uh, we did make good time though. Yeah, we did. We were make, flying. Yeah, we did make good time. Little boat. Should change the name from Sea Sprite to Green Flash because if you <laughs> blink, you'll miss it. Today's going to be a little more relaxing. The autopilot's even working today. The, the autopilot was completely on strike yesterday. Was having none of it. Yeah. Good morning, sailors. We're here at River Dunes Marina. It's near Oriental, North Carolina. Absolutely beautiful marina, resort marina, floating docks, uh, five-star luxury level uh, accommodations, boater's lounge, showers that are so complex you need a PhD to be able to operate them. 
restaurant, uh, you know, five-star restaurant. Beautiful, had dinner there last night with some friends who came over from New Bern to meet us. Today we'll cast off and uh, hopefully sail a little ways uh, down the Noose River towards Adams Creek where we'll have to turn on the Iron Jenny and kill another dinosaur to get down to Beaufort where we'll stage for our, the first of our offshore legs. So as usual, come aboard SVC Sprite. And I don't know if you're gonna have to hold fast today. It's pretty calm out there. We took a slip at Town Creek Marina and really enjoyed our time in Beaufort. We especially liked walking along Front Street and looking at the, all the awesome yachts that were tied up at the Beaufort Town Docks. We even went to the barber shop and got cleaned up a bit. Join us next time as we sail offshore from Beaufort, North Carolina to Wrightsville Beach. Until then, hold fast.